Jason Ball is preparing for a grand final next week, but an even bigger challenge for him is being openly gay in a hostile environment. The footy club was, to me, probably the last place that I'd ever want to come out. Um, it's always, you know, gay slurs are a regular part of the games and training and just sort of makes you feel like you're not welcome. Football has been a part of Jason Ball's life since he was five. But it was only when he came to terms with his sexuality at the age of 12 that he began to feel out of place. Without having any, you know, gay AFL players out there who are open about it, it just feels like maybe you're the only one. Although his team is supportive, he says it's time for the AFL to take a leading role in fighting homophobia across the game. He wants to see the league establish a pride round and broadcast this ad during the grand final. Do something about it. The campaign already has plenty of support, with depression group Beyond Blue joining the cause. They have to do more. The fact that uh, no professional AFL players have come out and expressed their sexuality uh, indicates that there's a culture problem right across the AFL. In a statement, the AFL says it supports the No to Homophobia campaign and is committed to social inclusion. The league has so far ignored calls to screen the ad during the grand final and introduce a pride round. I think if I was 12 again and found out that I was gay, if I had a positive role model, if I knew that there were gay AFL players, that would have uh, made a world of difference to me. In the meantime, Jason Ball will continue to fight for a fairer playing field. Stephanie Anderson, ABC News, Melbourne.